guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm going to be showing you how to make some clay coil pots with air dry clay. So here I got some Crayola's air dry clay. And to get started, you have to take a little bit of clay and then you have to roll it up in a ball. And then once you have gotten it rolled up into a perfect ball, then you will kind of smush it to make the bottom of your clay pot. Okay, so once you got the bottom of your clay pot already and flattened, you can take some more of your air dry clay. You can like take a little bit of it and you'll just roll it into a coil. And then that'll be the coil for your coil pot. Okay, so once you've rolled out your coil, it can be any thickness depending on what kind of pot you want to make. If you want it to be a, like a smaller pot, then you want it to be thicker, whatever. So once you're done with that, you're going to score it with like a butter knife or anything. And you don't want to make too much of an indent just want to lightly score it and that'll help hold it together once you put it on your pot once you're done scoring you will start to score the bottom of your pot so the coil that you scored will stick onto it better. So once you've got the bottom of your pot scored and your coil, you will now wet the bottom of your pot, the parts that were scored. Once you're done wetting it, you will take your coil and you'll just set it on the scored parts. So once you meet the other end of your coil, you will have to score the top of that one and do the whole process all over again of scoring it and wetting it. So now I'm going to re-wet it. And then once you do that, you'll just keep on repeating the process of scoring and wetting and making a coil so let's just keep on repeating the process
right, so this is the finished product, and you can like turn it around and you can look and see if there's any like cracks or anything, and then you can just take like some water and put it on your finger and just like rub the cracks and then they will like kind of just go together and there won't really be too much of a crack there anymore and then what you also can do put some more water on your fingers and you can smooth it out So here's my pot. Okay, so once you're done with your pot, stick it outside in the sun and it'll dry in like one or two days. And then, yeah, you can paint it and like do whatever you want with it really. So, I'm gonna let this one dry and I'm gonna go paint one that I already had made. We have our finished pots all painted and everything. And so here they are. This is my coil pot. This is my coil pot. Well, mine is, is a sunflower with a smile in the middle. So, thanks for watching. Hope you guys like this video. And it's just another one of those things to do during quarantine. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Bye. Bye, guys.